Back to the game cave. I am Josh. This is Star Wars Jedi Survivor. And yes, yes, I did just drag a roller mine <laughs> from there to here because I didn't know where else I could get a, a roller mine. And I found this bridge, and you could just walk across this little area. So I just pathed all the way through town and brought the roller mine here. So let's see what uh, what this is. It's gonna be nothing, isn't it? It's gonna be like a hat. Oh, that's a big chest. We're going to die. Trust in the Force, Padawan. Oh, cool looking. What do we got? A gold bar? Santari. <gasps> That's her lightsaber. The lady that we've been uh, from the past. Hmm. Um, worth it? I don't know. These are these are cosmetics, right? The the lightsabers they don't actually do anything. <laughs> well, whether or not that was a waste of time, who knows. <laughs> It's cool to get new stuff though, right? Also, we have some uh the rumors that we've been finding. So we've got uh the Hollow Tactics game from the uh boiling place, and we have the rumor about the um the fisherman up here. We got to go find John. He was born to be a harvester of the sea. So, we're going to go do that. Yeah, what's this? Forced here. Oh. There's a check mark on it, Josh. You already done did it. Just like that one. Okay. I don't know all of the symbols and signs. Uh, come here. You know your way around Kobo, don't you? Um not sure what that has to do with anything. Do do do, 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 do. Hey! Alright. Good job, team. Bye. <laughs> it's just one single droid. Just out here thinking he could take on the world. Wait, can I use the super jump to get... Because there's... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I use the, the, the super double jump from this thing to get into... Ha 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 ha. Oh. <laughs> we'll get around faster now. Come on. There you go. Ooh. Not a bad find. Eh, I've had better. God damn it. <sighs> One of these days. Alice. <laughs> Bang! Zoom! Straight to the moon. I like how it tells me. Whoa! Gra graphical, graphicals. I like how it tells me the things that I've gotten. Uh, fish. This way. And we need to talk to Z about these data disks and see what Z data disks give us. Um, I also want to find out what the hell these, because I got the hunter lightsaber. Yes. Hmm. Hmm. I don't think I can make that. Can I make that? Yeah. Oh! Oh my God! Bye, Yoshi. 
<laughs> Am I a bad person? We got one. Hello. Here we go. Attack! Give me more! You need to do better than that! Leon, How come they can attack during my thing? Damn it! Little help, ED. Yes, thank you. I know what the heal button is. Wow, that was really frustrating. They kept being like just slightly off from each other. Oh, I can remove steel plating from the walls. Ooh, before we dive into the pit of despair. <gasps> That's a serum. Just have to be patient, young Padawan. Ooh, ooh, ooh. A CEE2. -E oh no, I can't bring a roller mine here. Let's get, some, let's get some air up in this room, girl. Oh my god, that's. Wait. Uh, just one second. I barred the passage. I'm, I'm sorry. Farewell. Oh, a newcomer. Who are you? I'm Cal. This is BD1. Are you here to rescue us? Us? We're just exploring. How long you been here? They have a bandolier. We have been trapped down here for at least a standard cycle. Maybe more. We? Ah, oh, yes. It is just me. And has been for some time. But you have cleared the way. Are the raiders gone then? We took care of them. Maybe you should leave before more come. Yes. I will return to the outpost at Rambler's Reach. Yay! Had a domicile there. That means house. I hope to see you again. My favorite usage of the word, yay! My favorite usage of the word domicile came from Futurama, where the uh, the Amazonas' um, comedy club was referred to as the drollery domicile. Ugh. The smell down here is potent. Are these bombs? They sure are. Regrowing bombs. Excellent. Can I take one to the surface? <laughs> My son. My boy! Well, they don't seem to be hostile. I didn't need BD1. Can't go this way. Can't go this way, huh? Yeah, that looks like death. So I bet when we gotta get the elevator work. God damn it. Good deal. Droids. The raiders have rigged this place. Don't think I'll be able to move it. Not until we get better telekinesis. There's also that skiff that somebody had that was uh, locked up. So I'm assuming that at some point we get the ability to move significantly larger objects. Maybe we have to go talk to Yoda. Oh boy. Where are they coming from? Hey! Fucking bastards. Hey! The funky cat. The funky cavern? Really? The funky cat. Okay. Okay. I'm ready. How do I. How do I leave? Because I believe I fell in a hole. Down in a hole! Oh, that was a workbench. Oh. Well. 
Hmm. God, that's cool. I actually had a Star Wars D and D campaign one time, where um, we were we were dark siders, and um. The crew of our ship was uh, growing discontent with our um, rulings. And why are there so many different ways into this building? They were growing discontent with our rulings. And um, as a show of force, my buddy, he... Because um, I don't know if you, what you guys know about Star Wars D&D, but in Star Wars D&D, when you use the force, it uses your health. Um, or at least it did back then. Um, the rules might be different for modern. Um, but, uh, so my buddy, he, he used the force to fly, uh, destroy all of the computer screens. Like, like just, like, big explosion in the thing. Fly up, go over to the door, uh, the bulk to head door. Rip it off the hinges, throw it to the side, fly out of the room. As, like, a show of, like, don't fuck with me. The hilarious thing is that as soon as he was out of sight, um, he, uh, he immediately fell over into a heap because he was at negative one HP. <laughs> Damn it. What are we looking at here? Hmm. Oh? Find something? Child's hideaway. Oh, that's so sad. Hello. Hmm. Down in a hole. Yeah, I need to get one of those explosive things up here, but I can't. I'm pretty sure this is the elevator. And I would be able to like grab one of those things, pull it up here and launch it into the building. But that is not what I am capable of doing just yet. What does that sound? Oh. Seeds. Wonder where I could plant these. Uh probably somewhere eventually. How do I... That's two stims that we know about. One's behind one of those red doors. I don't think I can run along that. It looks like I can though. Oh yeah, and there's some uneven bars. So how do I get up there? I can't get up on this building with a Neko, can I? No, nope, can't make that. Can I climb? Man, there's a- oh, okay. <laughs> well, whatever traversal mechanic that is, we'll be back. Still, we managed to get another recruit, so that's good. Now let's go talk to uh, John over here about coming to fish for us. Talk to Scuba. What's your name, lad? If I'm to hold a grudge, best to know the name. I'm Cal. Boy. Speedy one. My bantable mum dubbed me Scuba Stev. Scuba the Fisher, am I? You know, there's a fish tank down in Pylon. Scuba Saloon Steve? Really? Pylon Saloon? That'll have an infested watering hole down in your valley. All right, all right. You know, yeah. Ah, fine, twist my arm. I'll do it. Meet me at the saloon and we'll appraise this so called tank. Is that the same guy that does the voice for. Ooh. Oh, this is how I'm supposed to get over there. Not by sacrificing Yoshi. Got it. 
All right, <laughs> now that we have the fisherman. <laughs> <laughs> well, it worked, didn't it? I don't like that it says open path because I don't have the ability to get the, um, I don't have the ability to get the blast thing up here. Wait. Where's the elevator? So that's the elevator right there. Would lead to, oh, would lead to there. I wonder what this is. Maybe it's plugging something? Hmm. Uh... I hate that the, the, the light is green, or the door is green, just because I have the ability to blast it open, but I don't have the means of getting a blast to it. So that's frustrating to me. Because then you look at the green and you're like, am I doing something wrong? Where are you, fireflies? I heard you. Just a golden cicada. All right, so um, let's see if Doma has anything new. It's a pleasure to have you. It's a pleasure to have you. I think I'll browse a little. Spice man. I'm the spice man. Frontier. Oh, I kind of like Frontier. You got a good eye. <laughs> you got a good eye. Oh, ban a bandolier with a training shirt. Oh, can we be Rambo? I'm gonna get me a new hairstyle. Let's see. Shag. Oh, take a look at that. Real windswept. There you go. Bam. There you go. That's a shaggy man. That's what I look like when I'm not working out. All right, workbench. Let's yes. get to work. I want to see what this lightsaber. I want to see what this lightsaber. Um. Blade. Whoa. Hunter. Oh, so it didn't. Oh, I see. So it just gave us the entirety of their lightsaber. Oh, that looks cool. Oh, yeah, I can dig it. Nice symbol. Yeah, I'm going to go with that, though. <sighs> Diligence looks neat. Hunter looks a little rough. We're going to go with that. Hey, oh, how do you not? How do you not? What does hers look like? Boring. <laughs> what does the hunter tip look like? Oh, the hunter blade looks so cool. I think I'm going to stick with Jaro though for the emitters. Yeah? Yeah. Just so it matches. Let's test the weight balance. <laughs> yeah, cuz that's important. We get some new stuff for BD. Just try out some new stuff. Maybe a swooper. I get down with that. Audio sensors. Mm. Oh, it looks like a little hand. I love it. Ooh, sleek. I can dig it. Naked legs. Scrap your... Whoa. Ooh. BD's been working out. 
<laughs> like the new look? I do. All right. Now that we've properly fussed with some cosmetics, let's try and find oh, Z. Shut up. This is the bar, isn't it? Oh, we got security? Neat. <laughs> hey, it's looking brighter in here already. That's a good sign. Grease always had an eye for eccentric art. Art, sure. Yeah, that's what that is. Ooh. Let's wash up. Yeah. Oh, look at that dirty ass mirror. Very helpful. Nice. Please tell me I can't pee. Oh, oh. I don't want to know how this got there. <laughs> I'm sorry. Is this gong droid wearing a tuxedo? <laughs> oh, this game's great. Let's go upstairs. Let's see what we find up here. Yeah, let's see. Oh my. Very fancy. But yeah. Oh. Oh, this is the uh, tank state dirty. It certainly is. How do we clean it? Hello, frog. Cal, I gotta confess something. Oh, God. Here we go. That tech I tried to sell to Ravis, there's more of it in the valley. A building right in the center. You can't miss it. We've already been there, Turbo, but thanks for the tip. Really? Well, is it too late to say that we split whatever you find 50 50 50? Maybe next time. 50 50 50? I'll hold you to that. Oh, well. Once again, we've already finished the side quest that somebody was to give us. Welcome, welcome. Whoa. Uh, why not step up and try your hand at Hollow Tactics, the game of sages and warriors? Al uh, our savior sure. returns. Let me make a proper introduction. I am Bima Ook, and this is my associate Tali Moon. As you can see, we have set up the game of Hollow Tactics here. What are you talking through? Saloon. I'm Cal. Glad you made it back safe. I'd say the same to you, but it seems there is no doubt that you can handle yourself. Damn right. I see you have a companion droid. They can add to your Hollow Tactics deck by scanning combatants. Oh. oh got it. The more scans BD collects, the more options I'll have in the game. Excellent. I exactly. press down all the time. Of course, there is nothing stopping you from playing right now. Challengers await. Ooh. Is that Frog Boy? Hollow Tactics! Select the opponent you like the challenge. Defeat each opponent and unlock unique rewards. How to play. Spend your bat. Is this Yu Gi Oh? <laughs> Spend your battle points to purchase units and place them on the table. A challenge lasts multiple waves. Losing a wave results in defeat, requiring you to restart the challenge. Winning. Additional battle points will be awarded each wave, and any unused points will carry over to the next wave. Win all waves to complete the challenge. Okay. Oh. That's a lot of big boys. I got a Wampa Stompa down there. Uh, let's start with Turkle. So it's a recording? When do I start talking? <laughs> I love Turkle. Whoa, we fight ATSTs? A security droid, holy shit. Oh, I only have six points. Um. Hmm. 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 Here you go, Shields Trooper. Dead center, baby. Start the fight. Hollow tactics! Oh, it never stood a chance! Dude, so this is just. I love the music. Looking good for cow. What a show. Yeah, baby. <laughs> Uh-oh. I got 12 battle points now. Ooh. Um How about we do this? We're going to do Uh we're going to do shield boy here. 
And a heavy assault trooper. Here. Get after it, boys! <laughs> Commence! Tank and spank, and baby! It's off the board. Oh my god. That unit is toast! Holy crap! Really? He fucking one shot my shieldman. Yay! Oh no! Oh, this is kind of cool. I dig it. My score. Uh, Grease for whoa, whoa! Oh, it's everybody that I've. Oh, I can get a fucking the Magnum PI mustache from him. So you think you can take on old Grease? Uh, maybe. Also, I like how your hollow thing made you taller than usual. 16 points, huh? Um. Hmm. Well, let's. Shieldman. And why not? Tried and true. We'll, we'll save ourselves four battle points for the next round. Advance! And it's a corner! <laughs> <laughs> Well, <laughs> shield troopers, not as effective as I thought. Um, well, what can withstand their dash? Try the melee droid. And, um... Hey! Come on, it's a 2v1. Man, Stormtrooper aim coming up big. They can't even throw their grenades far enough. Oh my god, it's a battle for the fucking century. They're all missing. This is ridiculous. Ooh, so long, farewell! This is a joke, right? Oh my god, is, he, is this one guy gonna get lucky enough that my guy just kept missing? Oh, it never stood a chance. oh my god, my grenade was mid-air between the two. Tactics. That's such bullshit! Turbo dog, how much do I earn? How much do I earn? So, Alright, one more try. On old uh... The commander, and then uh, a rocket trooper. I don't know. <laughs> Let the battle begin! Oh, so long, farewell! Oh, the rocket trooper is gonna be long range enough and to take him out <laughs> because there's no accuracy and involved. Excellent. Um, okay, so I know that the shield guy can withstand those front ones well enough to uh, solo them. And this is the second wave. So if we can save some points, that would be dip. So shield guy can do okay there. Let's put one rocket guy over here. Save six points, maybe. Combat! And it's a corner! No, no, stay away from the explosions! <laughs> but based on the last one, the rocket guy should actually be able to take both of these guys out. <laughs> this is so dumb! Oh, it never stood a chance! A well played round by Cal Kestis! Sure! Love to see it! Nailed it! Can I get an ATST, please? Oh, I'm three points away. No. <laughs> uh, 
Um, let's see here. I can do two security droids and a purge shock trooper. Eat dicks. Commence. And it's off the board. <laughs> this is the last wave, so there's no holding and back. Yeah, I didn't lose a single unit. That's how we do it, baby. I got a coat. Ooh, pilot. What? Wait, wait, hold on. Wait a minute. Why don't we raise the stakes a little bit? Shut up, Grease. <laughs> uh, so I can play that person. Um, is that a data disc? Oh, but they're level four. That might be a bit over my pay grade. Expand your forces. Drop by Scan and play enemies. A game of hollow right. tactics anytime. I don't know how I'm already able to um use Ah, Scuba, oh, here what? he is. Over this tank. Glad you came around to it. Hey, didn't he make a fetching first impression? Have a mind to give our third scrubbing. Cleaning the filter, you think someone tried to cram a boss through a sieve? Oh. <laughs> I don't hear that. Is this how I start being able to like clean and stuff? Uh, okay, never mind. How do I? Oh. Weird. So how do I start doing stuff with this? Um... Cool. Good talk. <laughs> There's more? There's so much more to this place than I thought there. Wow. It's the outside. This place could use what do you some got, greenery. <gasps> the rooftop garden! You've discovered the rooftop garden of Pilots of Loom, where you can plant seeds discovered on your journey. You can a special floor that collects seed pods and contain multiple seeds. So positive day new colors. Some put whoa, it's a hexagonal. Plants come in different sizes, with larger ones requiring more space to grow. You can unlock additional plots and gardening abilities by growing all your plants to full size and recruiting a gardener. I wonder if I could find someone to help. All right, let's try planting these seeds we found. Uh. And what do you think, BD? Here? Sure, let's just grow an entire field of Nabooan greens. It looks better when they're all the same, right? Now we wait. Am I doing it right? Man, gardening's easy. Tint. Oh, oh, the yellow would have looked. Actually, the blue looks beautiful. Okay. Is that the only plot that I have right now? Hiya! You better bring these to the garden. Ah, uh, shortcut up to the garden. Nice. <laughs> Every game's got to have a base building simulator. Hmm. Wasn't there a place I was trying to get to? To like try and like connect power? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I am Lord. Looks a bit overgrown. Uh. Hmm. Oh wait, I should be able to get on top of any building now, because I have the uh, the dogs. And by dogs, of course, I mean Nekos. Ah, uh, there's a there's a point in there. How does one? Huh. 
It's a thing. I guess I have to get the door open somehow, but how do I get power there? Hello there. Hello there. Hey, you. Yes. You're the one taking shots at the Raiders, right? That's me. Nice hat. Bad idea. The Raiders have got eyes all over the reach. Took down that watchtower, if that's what you're referring to. Oh, yeah? Well, let's hope there aren't any consequences for the rest of us. <laughs> I love finding all of the things and then well, they're like, look who it is. Well, Keeping look who busy. it is. There's always something to do. Well, you won't make a living talking to me. Unless you mean to rob me. Wasn't planning on it. Well then, have a wonderful day. It, okay. Good talk, I, I think. Yeah, because I can Let's do this ride, BD. to get up on any of them, right? But the question becomes, how do I get power to any of them? Because it looks like this is like the thing and I can connect it to various spots. Huh? Oh yeah, that's right. I sliced that, but then nothing came of it. can't like force pull it out Whoop. <laughs> yeah no power uh it doesn't look like that's a jack of any kind hmm Maybe if I, like, as I find people to move in. Because Z, the droid that I just found, said that she had a dome of Oh, is this her? Oh, hello there again, Cal. Hello. It is good to see you. You too. Is this the home you were talking about? Correct. Within there are some possessions. I don't suppose they will need them anymore. So feel free. You walk okay. in and there's just, like, dismembered sure? humans. I have no need for them. For your help, I insist. Alright. And now we have permission. Hey. One box full of stuff. Oh. Duelist. What is that? Hey. Ooh, very rustic. And it has a cape. <laughs> kind of. I like it. That's it. Oh, okay. What else were you expecting? All right, I already talked to you. I like that you can't talk to them multiple times, so it's like it's easy to check off which ones you've had conversations 20 with. Twenty cycles ago, heard this town was nothing but a few shakes. Now look at it. Yeah, sometimes I wish I could go back there, see what it was really like to rough it. You could always head into the wilderness and start your own town. <laughs> I think I'll stay here, thanks. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> well, you can always go start your own. Yeah, I'd rather complain about the state of things as they currently are rather than work to go find my or make my own shit. Hmm. I just want to be able to get into these buildings. It's so frustrating that I can't. Eh. Cest la vie. Eh. Hey, fellas. <laughs> eh. We've been together. Too, Too long. long. We were one Too of the first long. people here, and both tried scouting the pirate. Had zero idea what we were doing. Couldn't find anything. 
then I remembered I hate the outdoors. And I got a sunburn on my gastrodermis. Not fun. <laughs> then I caught sight of the most pathetic, bumbling prospector ever to walk the planet. Rumsey Forlow. Me too. Of course, we both started making fun of clumsy Rumsey. I laughed at Gulu Zingers. And I at Guido's. And we've been stuck together ever since. Because we shared something special. Rumsey was a loser. <laughs> Still puts a smile on my face. <laughs> what the fuck? <gasps> something you need. I need to get into that house you're standing in front of? What the fuck? I'll say this about Star Wars. A lot of interesting character designs. If nothing else. Can I get into that building? Looks like a f fucking military base. Won't open nope. from this side. I'm always on edge when fishing for the finger-lipped garpon. What a name. And fierce as they come. But that doesn't deter the poachers. The poor garpon, despite its rarity, is a delicacy for the black of heart and a rumbly of belly. In we go! Oh, uh, good luck. Let's move, BD. What? Did you see that beauty? Two plump fins, a fine compliment to glands. <laughs> a scrumptious varicose tongue. All right, take it on easy. an empty stomach, Scuva. Hey, I can't succumb to the passions of the stomach. The garpon must live. Dad better get me mind off it. Then spin your tail. Sure, so, go for it. You wish to prick up your ears and receive the tail of Scuva? If you're sharing stories. We'll listen. There you go. Then you be a fool, my lad. A sordid tale will bring you nothing but grief and woe. Okay, well, if you're not sharing stories, we'll... Oh, fine, I'll tell you. At your own assistance, and at your own peril. My story begins at a small village on the frozen banks of Sankavi Tar. My home world. Nights black as quellfish in it. Winter so cold, a stern look can turn you to glass. Doesn't sound like the easiest place to grow up. Difficult, eh? From the moment your mother's milk froze on your tongue to the moment you found it upon frozen streets. You see, the fishes, they had the right of it. They dwelt far below the ice, where warm currents danced like ribbons in the wind. To fish so scarce a quarry. On account of the great fish famine, well, it's nearly a mild undertaking. But for all the belly aching now, there's a peaceful enough life for a He's wee a starfish on his helmet. Instinct for the rod. So you discovered your talent early. Such a talent was I, that as a lad, me hardly spotted my first prickly chin here. I was given an audience with Undun. <gasps> but that'd be a tale Not Undun. So can I fish and clean up the tank now? I have one fish. What we got in here? It's like green doors. There you go. Interesting, uh, interesting mechanic, the super jump. It seems really simple, but it, it does open up a lot. What'd you find, buddy? 
Is that a jail cell? A list of grievances? I wonder how long this has been here. What? Oh. Okay. Oh, it looks like there's a, a hole there. Wonder where that leads. Hmm. Boy, I can't wait to start getting some traversal mechanics. I just like exploring a whole lot. All right, now there's a shortcut up to the garden, which is also a bit closer to the... Um, I need to stabilize a Neko too. So, ah! Okay. How long does it take for this stuff to grow? Garden's looking kind of respectable. Is it? Garden can use some of the new seeds I found. Sure. Not like I don't have thousands of them. Garden's looking pretty respectable. Respectable. Respect. Hey. What? Hey. Uh, Scuba's not here. So where's the finger lip garland? It says that it's there. Fish collected one of 12. I'm so confused by this. I think I actually have to go and find the mantis now. No, what? What's this? Approach bad. Monk, you back there? There he is. Word is there's a traveling troubadour and a DJ droid from the core worlds on Kobo. Not what I expected you to say. Any <laughs> idea whether they're there? They've hiked out onto the valley plateau to sample the sounds of the wild. And the sounds of the wild can come from creatures that kill you. Can't drop those beats if you're dead. I'll see if I can find them. I suspected as much. Cool. Till next time, pal. Oh, this is such a cool system where like you hear rumors and stuff and then you go around and you find people. You Hello, Zig. Anything useful out here? Tons. As soon as something breaks with the Raiders show face, folks have been in their projects. So Kobo's a gold mine for scrappers like us. <laughs> you got that right. Us, huh? What up, Kaish? Is your ship outside? Yeah. What's it to you? Kinda gonna be pleasantly surprised when someone brings some class to this rock. Was that a compliment? Was it? Sorry, I'm too busy being aloof. Hey, this is looking nice. What up, Toa? Oh, hey, it's you. I saw you tearing through the woods. Remember me? Name's Toa. I'm a historian. Freelance these days. Cal, also freelance. You planning on doing more exploring? Of course. This is my first time beyond the mid rim, but I can already tell this place is a trove. Centuries ago, folks couldn't wait to scratch out a living under a new sky. And hell, they sure chose a vibrant world. Vibrant, no better. Huh? Hey, let me know if you find any more of those chambers, yeah? Will do. Um. Hey. I did. Oh, well. Listen, friend. Moron. What's your name? It's Cal. Moran. Charm. Moron. You seem a decent sort, Cal. Look, maybe you're just the latest fool to get tangled up with the Bedlam Raiders, or maybe you're the real deal. But this place will bleed you dry. Understand? Get out while you can. Noted. Another time. Okay, pessimist. I choose to be optimistic. Oh, this is... Oh, he slides back here to make food. Oh, cool! Oh, I do like it when things look, are, like, neat like that. It's so neat. Hmm. Is it neato or neato burrito? So the tank goes all the way down to be behind Monk. 
Hmm. Where was the the mantis? Oh, it's out back at the helipad. I was looking for Grease in here. I'm assuming he's the gentle fellow with whom I need to confer about stuff. About stuff. Whoa, you can see the gates from here. Oh, that's so cool. There's the mantis. Oh, I wasn't running. I thought I was. Hey, there's Z. Uh, um, there we go. Z. You're looking good as new. Indeed. That mechanical mixologist is a miracle worker. I must know. Did you locate the key to Tannenor? Uh, it's complicated. But we'll find it. Monk told me what transpired while I was asleep. To think the Jedi Order is no more, that must have been dreadful for you. Is the I'm we sorry, does this robot have more so empathy much. than half of America? Severe, Cal, after all, what else is there to do? That's right. We've got room for one more? I shall remain here, but if you need my counsel, I will be at the saloon. I need to find out what these I data discs are for. To have met you, Cal Kestis. I found something out there. Well, yeah, what do you got? Another holocron? A Jedi. From the time of the High Republic, somehow preserved in Bacta. Dagon Gera. I freed him. What happened? He attacked me. Escaped with the Bedlam Raiders. He's who they've been looking for. Says the Jedi betrayed him. And turned to the dark side. Are you okay, kid? Tantalor. It's real, Grease. It's hidden somewhere in the Abyss. Oh, that's impossible! The Abyss eats any ship that gets too close! The Republic found a way through hundreds of years ago. That's why they built that array in the forest. A hidden world that nobody has been able to reach for centuries. If you figured out how to cross the abyss, you could just disappear completely. No Bedlam Raiders, no bounty hunters, no Galactic Empire. I'm just spitballing here, but that does sound like a place that someone could call home. Yeah. Yeah, it could be a home. Get your feet down. Ah. All right, I'm going back to the cantina. You know, Grease, we could use a real pilot. I don't know. I mean, you're doing okay on your own. I mean, you could clean the Patoli weave every now and again. We don't know the Mantis like you do. Nobody does. Oh, Cal, I'm, I'm sorry. My best days are behind me. I, I can't even hold my card steady. I know things are different from how they used to be, but well, I'm not sure I could do this without you. Oh, come on. Is that really how you feel? It is. Well, I mean, I guess I could have Monk keep his eye on the saloon. Greasy money. <laughs> <All right. laughs> oh, he's so happy. I mean, there's not going to be much in the way of credits. God, this is better than any score. Imagine, no more looking over your shoulder. A safe place for us, for the ones we love. If anyone knows about a lost Jedi world, it's here. Jedi! Aha! It's about time you paid that lady a visit! <laughs> All right, I'm gonna make us some food before we go. <laughs> I missed Grease. Coming into the mantis and hearing his voice. Welcome back to the outpost. Don't forget to visit Domus for any with any rare minerals you find and plant seeds in the rooftop garden. Cal can meet more residents who can help improve the outpost, even on other worlds. Interesting. 
Z's shop unlocked. Hooray! Z's shop in the upper floor of the Pylune Saloon is now accessible. High Republic data disks found here across the galaxy can be spent here. Rooftop garden. Gross. It looks it looks so smattering. Seeds collected across Kobao can be planted here. Jetta! So there's only seeds on this planet. Gotcha. Meet Siron Jetta. That's gonna be some good times. Getting the band back together? Hell yeah! Um, it did say upper floor. So let's go this way. Wee! Wee! Got a solid beginning here. Let's yeah. build on it. Thanks, Kel. Oh, it's loading. That's what the slow entry is that hey oh Cal, how good to see you it is you too Z. should you find any data discs from my day I'd be happy to decrypt them for you I imagine there are many that remain lost on Kobo we'll let you know if we do behold imports Remarkable, isn't it? <gasps> what? Oh, I can play her for a data disc. I can get a perk slot right now. Oh, and she sells perk. This is a way better. Ooh, stuff for BD. Um, this is a way better shop. All right, what do we got? Equilibrium damage up. Fuck yeah. Using a force ability increases the damage of the next lightsaber attack. Interesting. Deals extra damage temporarily after switching lightsaber stances. Soon. Also interesting. Gain more experience from defeating enemies. Ugh, really good. Super meter, elixir. Healing stems also feel a small amount of the super meter. Oh, is that the slowdown? But it's not, it doesn't say slowdown meter. Do I have other supers that I can get? Regenerate a small amount of force over time, but maximum force is reduced. No interruptions. Absorb one hit without being interrupted while sprinting. Interesting. Obviously, we're going to go with the perk slot first. But I think if I'm going to go with one after that, it's definitely going to be wisdom. Right? I mean, those are cool, but wisdom's the best. Right. So that's going to be the end of the episode. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate the fact you do. And if you're enjoying the content or not, make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. All that good stuff. And we will see you on the next one. Peace.